What's up everybody? Mike coming back with another uh, video for you from Steel City Rips. Um, had a little trip to Walmart, or um, this was actually Target, and um, found a couple little things. I've been keeping an eye out for uh, this capstone. Um, I know it's probably not the most amazing product, but it includes um, a free uh, mem or auto card, auto card for 25 bucks kind of hard to pass up on just to see what's in there i guess you know um for a retail product and then um prism and another uh random select pack that they had left over hanging so for basketball so thought i'd give another one of those a shot just because it was hanging out by itself um no pun intended and then um the uh the prism there's just some cool like the white uh basically the white diamond kind of look like uh like that um they're just sweet looking, so maybe you'll get lucky and get a Julio. I think I have a uh, Bobby one of those hidden away somewhere that I pulled. was really pumped about that. So um, let's start with the uh, Prism. Let's just see what's in there, and then we'll get ripping on the other ones. So <clears throat> in Prism, not probably the best product in the world, but let's just see what we got here. So all right, Rivero. There's a torque right, right off the bat there. We'll take that, right? Maybe if uh, he can come up and, you know, hit like he does in the minors, that, that'd be pretty sweet, you know? Robbie Ray. Yohan Duran. That dude throws gas, by the way. Absolute heater. Contreras. Nicky Lopez. Flip around. Zach Short. Romar Navarez. I feel like that, is that guy a pirate killer? I feel like maybe. Um, but it might be relevant now because they got uh, William Contreras, who's an absolute stud. I love that guy. Jake Burnett's Joey Votto on the Fearless. I don't think that's anything special. Brian De La Cruz on the red, white, and blue. Matt Veerling on the red, white, and blue. Jordan. Mookie. Olsen with a sweet print line on the side there. Marishal, a little throwback there. Andre Jackson. So off center Andre Jackson. So nothing amazing. And I actually I did get a red, white, and blue Bobby in one of these before too. So that was actually pretty nice. So like you know, there's a there's Bobby in there, there's Julio's in there. Um so nothing too outstanding. Um, you know, I like keeping all the Yordan and Mookie cards, but you know, nothing too too crazy coming out of that pack, unfortunately. So but let's move on to the basketball. Take a look at what's in there. I actually went through my last opening of this and realized that actually a couple of the cards were worth some money. And I think I just saw something on the back there that might be awesome. So Trey Young, base, Donovan Mitchell, Keon Johnson, Jimmy Butler, a couple of the same things I've already gotten. <laughs> they must pack a lot of the same stuff in these things. Jalen Suggs, rookie. Chris Paul. Crusoe. James Bonite. I don't know if that guy's any good. Premier level. Al Horford. Is that a premier level prism for Al Horford? We'll take that. I know he's an all right guy, all right player and a good team. Um, that's probably something worth keeping an eye on, right? So wait till we get these shimmers here. There's a LeBron numbers. Uh, Rajon Rondo still playing. Trey Young. So I know he's a good player. Pretty sweet print line right through the middle of it. But all right, a couple of uh, oh, nice. Oh my God, look at that. <laughs> the quality on these stuff like blows my mind. Um, I feel like every video, I, <laughs> I don't want to complain, but good God, man. Is it retail? Like, is it, does Hobby come out with the same stuff? You guys let me know if you guys see the same stuff in Hobby. Um, geez, oh man. That's crazy. Um, but I think I inadvertently pulled a, in my last video, a Premier uh, Silver, like a Prism, and didn't really even realize it that I did. And I looked it up and, I mean, it probably like paid for the pack on, on what it was. So, wasn't too, wasn't too mad about the last pack, so I'll have to look up and see 
um, who's worth what in basketball nowadays. So, all right. Last but not least, the capstone. I've been kind of keeping an eye out for this. I wanted to open this and see what this was all about, and I'm still looking. I cannot find any, like, mosaic football out there because I think people are buying it up for um, trying to find the Brock Purdy's and stuff. Um, don't blame them because, you know, he's kind of writing that – he's he's doing that Brady kind of thing where he came out of nowhere. So I have to keep an eye on that guy. Jose Miranda, pretty good player. And then let's see, Hunter Green. That's a good one there. These are neat looking cards, though. I mean, the uh, it doesn't do it justice. These are on a little bit thicker card stock too. Kind of hard to see, but the the prism effect on these cards, you really don't. It's not doing it justice. Kyle Muller, a lot of rookies already, huh? And then Tim Anderson, blue parallel, just a retail parallel, but pretty cool. Big Bang, Javier Baez. Um, Hunter Green's definitely a good one as far as that goes. Oh, cool. They fit in the regular sleeves. I'll take that. And then uh, Jose Moran is definitely a guy. I kind of have in a, I have like a big box with my main rookies, and I got a little side box of like maybe maybe guys, you know, just so it's you don't lose track of where that is. Um, a couple more sleeves out here. All right. Next pack here. Jaron Duran, looks like that right off the bat, or I opened backwards, how about that? Jaron Duran blue um, retail parallel, which is pretty cool. Um, not a bad rookie there. Hoping, hoping that guy ends up doing a little bit of something. Well, these are some tight, tight ones here. I don't think I want to mess around with that. We'll do that later. Byron Buxton, Liam Hendricks, Johan Duran. Austin Hayes. All right. Keep it moving. All right. Backwards again. Joe Musgrove. Jeff McNeil. Oh, there we go. J-Rod. We'll take that. Carlos Correa with the Summit. And then Gavin Sheets. Blue parallel there. I don't know if this is going to work or not. These these sleeves, I don't want to screw this card up. But it's pretty tight. There we go. Hope there's some tight sleeves. I don't know what those ones are. All right. Moving on. A little thicker pack. Maybe this is our, our mem or our auto. I've heard some Curtis Terry's and stuff coming out of here. Matt Olson, Josh Donaldson. Let's see Machado. Well, it's pretty neat looking. Connor Wong, I mean, could have been a better player, but um, yeah, there's definitely a auto back there. Mike Trout on the blue parallel. We'll take that. That ain't too bad. We'll save this for last here. I think that's our auto or a mem. All right. Corbin Burns. Joe Perez, Devers, Royce Lewis on the cool print. I'm, I wonder what they call that print. That's pretty sweet. Ryan Pepio. All right, one more pack. All right. Jose Ramirez, Manoa, one of my guys, Clay Kershaw, Carlos Rodon, Shane McClanahan with the Blue, I guess you could call that a, a color match parallel. So nothing numbered that uh, yet. Maybe we'll get lucky and get the numbered, uh, the numbered auto mem or something. So, all right, let's see here. Oh, let it be an auto, guys. No, nope, nothing. Oh, we didn't get a mem or an auto. Just a uh, fake out. <laughs> Oh, they did us dirty because I was backwards and everything. Oh, I got real excited. That would have been cool. Uh, did we really miss out on that? Or am I just... Uh, let's go through here real quick. They dogged us. I mean, I know it says on average, but... Come on. 
Yeah. Oh my gosh. Doing us dirty. Someone write Panini on that one, huh? Oh, fake out. I mean, <laughs> I don't know. Would I rather have an extra card or? Yeah, see? One autograph or one mem per box on average. This was the one box sitting there. So maybe some nerd went in there and like measured all the boxes. I don't know. Like uh, weighed them. I don't know. That's so dumb. Um, not even, I didn't even see a numbered card, um, to make up for that. I think Panini puts them on the, the backside. So one quick sweep real quick and then just bear with me, you guys. Cause this, do we get dogged guys? If we got dogged. I'm just tell you right now, don't buy this crap. Cause this is, uh, a little disappointed. I mean, it's 25 bucks. It's whatever. Um, but I, I went from thinking I maybe had an Olin Aeronauto something, you know, even a mem to, you know, absolutely just, you know, base Julio maybe worth five bucks. So nothing, nothing. Connor Wong let me down. Royce Lewis. But that is a cool looking background on those. Jeff McNeil. Nothing. Clan of hand, no number. So yeah, guys, we got a little, a uh, little bit screwed on that, I think. So um, it was weird. There were some weird mixed up backwards cards and things like that. So, but hey, it is what it is. But hey, quick little retail opening for you guys. Um, coming up in the, hopefully the next couple weeks, we got um, some uh, Bowman Sapphire coming for you. So hopefully that'll be uh, something, something pretty good to open. Um, I watched a couple of the top Sapphire videos and uh, saw some disappointing stuff going on. So I, was, I'm, I went in for the Bowman hoping some of the prospects would make up. So it looks like they pulled out a lot of the uh, no-name players and put in some some prospects. So uh, wish us luck on that. But I'm excited. Looking forward to that video for you guys. Um, keep an eye out. But thanks for watching this long. Hang with me. Uh, we'll keep them coming. Just keep liking and subscribing. Um, trying to grow this channel, grow this, grow with you guys, and kind of watch me grow through this hobby. So, um, looking forward to sharing that experience with you guys. So, we'll catch you on the next one. Take care.